I, uh, I didn't watch this. I didn't. I, I watched some of Let's Make Big Moves, but I lost interest and stopped watching. Look at what I'm looking at here. You think this is fun? You think this is exhilarating? Grand Finals is mad hype. Well, we are going to be watching Grand Finals. I think that's... Yeah, literally right there. That is a 30-minute set. Without further ado, we're gonna be watching the Winners Finals and Grand Finals and Let's Make Big Moves, and we're gonna be asking ourselves the ultimate question. Is Pokemon Trainer back? Well, that depends on how many tournaments uh, this young fella goes to. Quid. Yeah, we're gonna be watching his, uh, his brazy run and winning Let's Make Big Moves, a major base in New York. New York City! Home of the Big Apple, the city that never sleeps. All right, I think Peachy's broken, I think Peach is broken, but I think Peach is a little less broken. So, who do you guys think will win? Who do you guys think I think will win? I, uh, you know, I don't know why people stop playing PT, cause like, this character, good bro. This character's good, this character, easy. I, I've said it before, I'll say it 15 more times. People think PT's hard because you're playing three characters, but you know, it's, it's not that hard when you're using like three or four moves per character, so. Isn't PT all skill though? Look at the up air and down air hitbox of Ivysaur and tell me if that's all skilled. And look at the frame data of Squirtle and tell me if that's all skilled. And then Charizard, that character's just obnoxious. There you go. You just gotta roughly get the time on the down air. It'll hit. Yeah, this, this character benefits from platforms a lot. Like that. There's so many times where he'll just jump on the platform and down air and it'll be fine. It's it's, it's got like pirate energy, you know what I mean? Where you just, you just down air for fun. That was really good, like, uh, patience from Quid not to just throw something out in that moment where they were moving back and forth. He, he didn't swing for, like, 15 seconds, and then he did this brain dead forward air, and then next forward air. Very hard to contest. Kills. You watch my video without subscribing? You better sub right now or else your whole family's kaput, you feel me? That's crazy, man. They made a character like Squirtle. Sometimes I think Squirtle might be better than Pikachu. Chad, is that, is that a, that's my hot take of the day. Woo! Oh, that DI was rough. Yikes. There is no worse Pokemon than PT. That is just not true. There's what that that's there, there is a worse Pokemon. It's just like there's a worse character in the game. And it's ZSS, baby. That's why she's not in this tournament. Peach, uh, Peach has always had an issue with characters that had obnoxious hitboxes and that can deal with her movement with hitboxes, you know what I mean? And uh, Ivysaur is that. Mostly anti-airs too, which is exactly where Peach wants to be. That was not a true combo, but... Look at all those kill moves. Those are all kill moves. In succession. Would kill. Would kill. Would kill. Did kill. <laughs> Boom. Yeah, he tried to double jump away. Rookie mistake. Got a mash. Point! You know, fun fact, I used to play I- oh, rip. I used to play Ivysaur PM when uh, when she was broken. And uh, I played Wii Remote Nunchuck and it was filthy. Trust me guys, trust me, I played Ivysaur. I was right. Ivysaur was sick, yeah, true. Ooh, the beer reverse neutral B. Yeah, maybe that should work like that, because Toad was covering the wrong side. Yeah, that's factually wrong. Oh, no, not like this, not like this. Why are you pressing shield while you're mashing? Yeah, PT could snowball really easily because they could play at any pace they want. You, you have to play basically perfectly if you want to make a comeback versus Pokemon Trainer. Don't throw! Oh, my man's is getting red. He's playing good. Playing at kill percent against Ivy Sermon. Hard stuff. What a comeback. What a comeback. He SD'd at like zero. I actually didn't know that comeback. That was a crazy comeback. Oh, yeet. Take that turn it back. See ya. You got no options. That's a 50 50. You either up here early or you take the down air like that. You, you just do nothing and hope it works. He tried to kill him again at like 25. Yo, wait, what happened to. Oh, I remember the first stock got deleted. Damn. Yo, Mew plays so good and then DI something bad or SDs and then loses. What a spammer. <laughs> I'm gonna start calling top players spammers. Tell them that they're never gonna get better if they just keep spamming the same move. It's true. Yeah, dude. Leo just spams in air. Yeah, you don't wanna be a spammer. You wanna be a masher. Big difference. Oh, not the. That's just. No what is going on? The spaghetti. 
What was the up air for? Why'd you up air quit? That didn't make sense. God damn. That cheesy up VD. You know, fun fact, Leffen started that. The reverse up V under the stage. That was a Leffen thing. Is that gonna kill? Down throw? I wonder if that was a DI issue. Was that DI bad? It looks like he DI'd out. So I'm surprised he died. Why does Ivy Sword have two kill throws? Looks like, yeah, he died no questions asked. That's crazy. I mean, DI is huge. You could die to like ZSS up throw at like 150 or 200. <laughs> it's that crazy sometimes. How does PT have seven kill throws? Bro, I don't, I don't know. I really don't know. All right, next clip. Our next video. Did you guys see the picture that Aaron tweeted of Cola with all the snow on his hair? Because it snowed in New York. It's a very funny picture. All right, bro, I couldn't tell you who wins this matchup, no troll. I literally have no idea. I think I think PT has what it takes to edge guard and zone Roy. So I think I think if Cola ever gets to Grand's winner side, he'll beat whoever it is he's playing. The longer you play Cola, the easier it gets. That's typically true for most players, but I think it's rightfully like like even more true for like against Cola. Oh, duh, don't get comboed as Charizard. Get off that character. What are you doing? Get off that character. Roy loves this. <laughs> you should not be playing Zard against Roy. There's no reason. I guess it worked out. <laughs> Yo, Cola came down with the down air. He didn't want it anymore. Okay, he just ran, he runs down here. And he's like, die! Yo, what do you do about that? I don't even think I could react to three F tilts on my shield, dude. It's so fast. Ooh, schmixed up. Ooh, bad DI, bad DI, bad DI, bad DI, bad DI. Those were all like staggered down tilts. He didn't just mash it. Oh, yikes. Speaking of mashing, dude, I think that's, I think that's faster than Rob down tilt, and that's the crazy part. These guys are, look at this. Look at this spot dodge spam and Roy. He just falls out of it. Yo, this game is mid. That, the whole like four seconds, five second interaction there just sucked. Don't get up aired by Roy Champ. Oh, there you go. It, need, it needs to kill, guys. Razor Leaf has to combo or else Ivy Sword would be bad. So he agreed to go back here or is the stage list garbage? That's crazy. We're in 2022. Still no unified stage list. PT isn't corny. PT's corny. Nah, PT is mad corny. You're, you're one of two things. You're corny or you're cheesy. And this character's corny. Wow, what a good grab. See what I mean? You get used to Cola's like approach timings and stuff, his approach options. Because when Cola approaches, he's like, okay, does this person have enough time to react? Does this person have enough time to shield? And how, how are they going to respect my approach? I wish Cola learned how to up better. Obviously, that was a really good use of up but if he did that more, it'd be so annoying fighting him. That was such a good side to me. I was expecting a tech in, but uh, he called out Quid's composure. Most people would panic and tech in, but people who, uh, who are the right of mind, tech out. Or tech in place. That really killed Dan. Are you surprised, bro? Cole, I'm... Roy's broke. Deleted? I, I looked away. I love getting up by Roy. It's one of my favorite, you know, pastime activities. Can you please get off a of Charizard? Pull like, thank you. As a predictable forward air, and Cola knew it. He spot dodged immediately after he hit it. I jump off here. I jump off the platform. I'm not a coward. I want to see Quid parrying more. Because you can just call out the the, 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 the timing of the landing from Cola most of the time and just fish for a parry. Jer. Jer. Right back at it. True finals. Roy jabbing at ledge is very pug. You could be good at ledge jabbing, or you could be Roy jabbing at ledge. I like that he just mashed up air to hit stun. See ya! Oh my god, he's at it. Woo! Goodbye! Is that up throw up air with Ivysaur? What in the world? I learn something every day. And it's about stuff I don't want to know about. Like Ivysaur. Cover both sides. You can only tech out there. That did not hit, bro. Look how far away he was from the ledge. He was like high up and also not directly on the ledge. No way. That down smash was baller. I've never seen that down smash used so well. That was actually the cleanest down smash ever. He kept using down smash to cover landings at the ledge. Worked so well. It's so sick, dude. It like goes just like a little bit farther than most of Ivysaur's options too. So you don't really expect it, and it sends at a pretty nasty angle. Wow, yike. 
God, T taking Squirtle to Battlefield. Taking Squirtle anywhere. Playing against Pokemon Trader. There you go. That's the whole tweet. That sucks. Post nerf PT, by the way. Bro, how long ago were those nerfs and people still talk about that? Damn, that's that felt so random. Oh, he had it fully charging. I don't know why Cola overshot with the up The PT's still broken. PT's nerfed it. Next to nothing, dude. He's just getting frame dated on, dude. Cola is just spamming defensive options, too. He has no response. This is how it feels to play against Roy, Cola. How's it feel? He wanted him dead. That was just greedy. That was just no. That was not even almost a true combo. Oh, tech in every time. Cola's nervous. Oh, come on now. Stop giving it to him. Oh, he waited for the spot to air dodge, too. Oh, my man's just trying to game, and he tried to game too hard. Is this a 3-0? I think it's a 3-0. I'm calling it. I'm calling it. Oh, well, Quid's kind of mixing it up a little bit now. He's playing a little faster. And then he slows it down immediately. Never mind. He's just playing really well. Can't get a pin on it exactly what he wants to do. So many times, I think he's going to throw out a hitbox, and he just doesn't. That's not going to kill. No way. No way. Yo, how high up was that down air? That's crazy. That's crazy. Yeah, Ivysaur should be banned, bro. <laughs> I'd like to see how Quid does later on. I think he's very good. I think that kid is very talented. That's, and yeah, see, Mooncake, you're right. And that's why we should ban Steve. Guys, make sure you agree with me in the comment section while you're down there. Go ahead and click the subscribe button. Uh, comment, ban Steve. 